Every home game's an occasion here in Orlando. And as they came in earlier, the Magic were dressed for what they hope is a special night for them and their fans. And the game arrival, sponsored by Express. Dress like a pro. The skyline of Orlando is seen here during a gorgeous sunset. Quite a backdrop for our broadcast tonight. It's been an absolute war out there. Neither side giving in. Both want to advance to the next round. It's the Eastern Conference Playoff Game 6. Right here on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony, Hall of Famer Doris Burke. And another Hall of Famer, David Aldridge, from the sidelines. Hey, Dave. For most teams in the NBA, success starts at the top. The challenge for owners, most of whom don't come from basketball backgrounds, is picking the right person to entrust with roster decisions. That skill set is hard to evaluate sometimes, but getting that first decision right can sometimes make all the difference. Kevin? It sure can. All right, D.A., thanks. A look at Atlanta's opening lineup. Young and Herter make up the back. Hunter at the three with Collins at the four. And it's Len in at the five down low. And for the Magic, at the four and the five, we have Gordon and Vucevic. Fultz and Ross pair up to make the backcourt. And it's Isaac in at the three spot. So Atlanta will get the first possession. Young taking his time here. Herter passes to Young. Back to Herter. On the wing. It's hauled in by Gordon. Listen, offensively, they're very comfortable with him taking that shot. It's a good look under very little pressure. He just can't convert. Now, here is Young. This is it for Pell. Whistle blows. Basket is good. So a chance here for a three-point play. First point of the night, and you know this is going to be a battle of matchup. What's going to be fascinating to watch is which matchups are they willing to go exploit. What's up? Fultz with the ball. Grabs the miss. And the Hawks with possession. It's a three-point game. Here's Young. That shot is off. Gordon with the defensive effort. Here's Ross. Not wasting any time and taking the shot and knocking it down. Well, tremendous understanding from the young Jonathan Isaac. How about that awareness for the young guy? Back to Young. Lee Paz was put in just the right spot. Just setting the tone with an aggressive move to the rag. And, and where's the help defensively? To me, Greg, that's a complete lack of communication on that side of the ball. These guys need to be talking to each other. Gordon. That one's no good. 0 of 1 to begin the game. Here's her. Over to the wing. Just trying to shoot. From deep three-point range, it's hauled in by Gordon. And he's a good shooter from outside, but not sure from that deep. Boy, we're seeing it more and more. Guys looking to create additional space by stepping back further from the line. Now here's Vucevic. Here's Fultz. Nope, not that time. Nothing for two from the field. Here's Hurt. He's guarded by Ross. Pass to Young. Here's the three. That's it. He's got two made now, and he's shooting two for three. The first thing that jumps out at you about Young, that seemingly limitless shooting range and the spacing that affords for this offense. Yet another miss. Just one for five. Not exactly an ideal start. Pass to Len. Young outside. The pass to Hunter. Here's Hurt. He's covered by Isaac. For three. No good that time. 
And it's the Magic taking it the other way. Now Fultz. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. They need this one. And too long on the shot. Atlanta leading by six. On its way from Young for two. They grab their own. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. What a play. Wow. And that sort of showmanship is just deflating right now to a team trying to get back into a game like this. Ouch, Greg. That is definitely an emphasis jam. A big apostrophe or exclamation point. Maybe even a question mark. And momentum going the other way. Can, can they find some answers? I think here you have just got to get back to what you do best and then live with the results. Here's Carter Williams. There's 154 left to play in the first quarter. And he comes up with the deuce. What an effective, efficient offensive possession. They'd love to get that shot every trip down the floor. Marker against Carter Williams. Poke loose. It's stolen by Carter Williams. For three, Fournier. The basket good off the assist from Carter Williams. Well, you love the shooter's mentality that Evan Fournier possesses. Thinking of pulling up before he even makes the catch. Parker looking over the floor. He kicks it to Reddish. He feeds it to Jones. And Jones slams it in. Oh, taking it to the rack with power. Hammering down the two-hand slam. And here's Augustine. He's still scoreless so far in this one. They hold the early advantage on the glass. Bamba against Turner. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Pass to Augustine. And it's sent back by Turner. And he gets it back. Augustine, that's good. There's 14 seconds left in the first quarter. Oh, here's Barker. I'm deep. And he got that one up in time, but doesn't go in. And so the first quarter is in the books. It's Atlanta. They're up by five. 2K Sports, back in a moment from the Amway Center. Good to have you with us for 2K Sports coverage of Game 6. And when you consider how Atlanta is doing, your thoughts? What we saw in that first quarter, uh, they won their matchups defensively. I think across the board, a number of guys who've done a great job guarding multiple positions. The Magic trail by five. We've got DJ Augustine. Fournier out there with Aminu. Then it's Carter Williams. And it's Bamba in at the five. This is out there for Orlando. Carter Williams looks like he's floating out there, but has that deceptive first step. Parker passes to Parsons. Throws it down as the official calls the foul. It may be a three-point play. It goes on Muhammad Bamba. The D just kind of stepping aside and letting him get to the rim. There's a reason, G.A., the lead is what it is right now. I'll tell you, you can't get stops Find if you're lanes. unwilling to Find put the in lanes. the work. And 
And so it's Augustine who will bring it up for the Orlando Magic. They trail by six. The tray. That one falls. His second basket of the game. He's now two for three. And their shots are falling now with more regularity than we saw at first. On the wing, Turner. And by Augustine. Pass to Reddish. Six on the shot clock. Orlando grabs the miss. For three, Fournier. That one falls. His second basket of the game. He's now two for three. I love the decision making of Evan Fournier. Just fantastic at pulling up and rhythm. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. It goes on Muhammad Bamba. And you know what? You allow a guy to get right to the rim like that. That's your only option. The Atlanta shooting their third and fourth Take free break. throw shots Take of the break. night. Two shots. That free throw, no good. So Orlando going with an almost entirely new group here. Vucevic checked in for Mohamed Bamba. Aaron Gordon comes in for Al Farouk Aminu. Jonathan Isaac, he's checked in for Michael Carter-Williams. And Markel Fultz is subbed in for Augustine. And the Hawks will go for a different look here. Collins checked in for Parker. Hunter comes in for Chandler Parsons. Kevin Herter, he's checked in for Reddish. Young is subbed in for Evan Turner. Now, here's Fultz. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Here's Vucevic, and the officials call a traveling violation. Alex Lenz checked in for Atlanta. The Hawks leading. Young with the ball. He has five. Jacks up a three. Offensive rebound. And that one's good. Hunter. Hunter's got his first basket of the night. And one thing about Hunter, he never gives up. You can see the focus and energy that he plays with on every possession. Now here's Fournier. Six points for him. Shot clock at five. From deep three-point range, tries to keep it alive. And the Magic can hold on to the ball. Ross is checked in for Fournier. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Here's Young. Lays it up and banks it in. And it's a five-point Hawks lead. And having to respect Young's deep range defensively. Hard to close off the lane. Pass to Isaac. Now here's Vucevic. Shoots a fader, and it's good. Two points. Well, great to see Vucevic work that in between games, showing he wants to improve that game. Over to the left wing. And stolen by Gordon. Oh, and here we go with Gordon. Nobody back. Wow, how about the first? Aaron Gordon off the floor so fast. Don't sleep on him, gentlemen. You're going to look silly. Young from outside. Rebounded by Vucevic. And after nailing a three-pointer in the first quarter, he has yet to connect here in the second. And Fultz gets it to go. Well, exposing a weakness in the defense. That's just way too easy, guys. And Atlanta calls their first time out of the game. They're yeah, trying to stem the tide here. Yeah, this is why you hate to lose momentum. It can be hard to get it back.
So it's the Hawks now. They trail by one. Here's Herder. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. The Magic have gotten all but one of their seven shots in the second quarter to drop. Pretty impressive. Now here's Fultz. He's tightly guarded. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Fultz has got the lead up to three now for Orlando. Well, make no mistake, Markel Fultz, because of his athletic burst, can score on the interior. That's nicely done. Cowens finds Land. The Hawks looking the ball around, looking to end the run, and that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. It's going to be on Aaron Gordon. The Hawks shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. Yeah, in this quarter, they've had the right approach. Driving and drawing. Initiating contact. Create opportunities. Get to the line. Catching up on the changes for Orlando. Mohamed Bamba, he's checked in for Vucevic. Michael Carter-Williams comes in for Isaac. And D.J. Augustine subbed in for Markel Fultz. He doesn't get the second one. And the rebound battle split evenly thus far. And Augustine kicks to Ross. The pass to Gordon. Lock at six. Back to Ross. Outside for Carter-Williams. Fires from 18. Here's Gordon, and it's Gordon finishing it off. Boy, there is a will, a drive. Aaron Gordon showing he wants to be more active on the glass. Young best to come. Got it, and the Orlando lead has been cut down to two on the bucket from Reddish. And so it's Augustine who will bring it up for the Orlando Magic. 43 seconds left in the first half. Passes it to Gordon. Five on the clock. That's in Augustine with the assist. Gordon's got six points in the quarter. And this has been a great job of just getting into the middle of that defense and really scoring effectively from the paint. Young. It's good for his fourth bucket of the night. He's shooting four of eight. Such a creative ball handler. Young has an ability to carve out room for himself with his dribble. Augustine passes to Gordon. Here's Bamba. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. And he'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. And they keep hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. And he's got his first chance at the line here. And that one falls for Bamba. Well, Mo Bamba is the prototypical modern NBA big, right? The size combined with the shooting ability. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle underway in this one. Magic lead by five. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Kevin, thank you. Aaron, you all have played at a high level so far. What has worked for you? We're just sticking to the game plan. You know, uh, our coaches really drew up something good for us. You know, they wrote it out, and we're sticking to it, and we're executing very well. Yeah, that's obvious the way you all have played. Thanks for your time. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David, thank you. We'll be back after halftime for the start of the third quarter. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, folks, we hope you've enjoyed the first half. I'm Ernie Johnson. Next to me, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith. It's the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports. Checking out the Magic. They're locked in a battle tonight. And knowing that they're desperate to clinch the series here in Game 6, it's likely to be a rough, grinded-out second half. They don't want to let this opportunity get away from them. What did you think, Kenny, about what we saw from the Magic? Well, there was one pleasant surprise, and that was the bench. They gave him a big lift. Those guys came into the game, they did all the dirty work, and they scored baskets. And over to the big fella, your thoughts on the Hawks? Whatever their game plan was defensively coming in, that needs to change. Can't let a team shoot for a percentage of high pitch. expect to come out on top. It's on the coaches and the players to adjust. 
And it's just about time now for the third quarter to get underway. It doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. We have that question. Trey Young displaying his skills today. With so much on the line tonight, you have to be impressed with the way he came out and set the tone with his aggression. You get the sense when there's big time performances to be had, this guy wants to take part. You expect that this is a trend that will continue here. And we're with you again as our round one coverage continues. And so in the game for the Hawks, Herter the two with Hunter at the three. Collins at power four with Len at center. And it's Young in at the point. Now here's Ross. Fires top of the key. Basket good. Ross has got the lead up to seven now for Orlando. Uh, there's no quit in this guy. He just gives you great effort and he continues to give you great production. Len finds Young. And it's hauled in by the Magic. Well, he's a quality mid-range shooter, but he can't get that one to go. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. And that one is good. Isaac's got his first points of the night. They're consistently finding ways to get the ball inside and taking full advantage. Here's Young. That's in for his fifth make of the night. Now shooting at a 50% clip. Five for champ. You know, fleshing out his attack a little more. Young showing more of a willingness to go in there amongst the trees. Boy, that's three for four this half. You like that they're starting with a little bit of extra energy. Nice. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. And although he's smaller, Young willing to battle inside and shows you he can score through contact. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. And that one falls for Young. He's a guy you have to game plan for. The way Young scores and passes the ball creates so many problems for the defense. Here's Vucevic. Len grabs the board. Len's got his fourth rebound in this one. Hunter, the pass to Herter. Basket counts. They didn't have much of a problem getting the ball into the post that time. Magic leading by four. Volts kicks to Gordon. To the wing right side. Bounce pass Isaac. Outside Gordon. Down low. No good from Ross. I'll tell you, everything went right in terms of execution. He just can't get it to go. Hunter takes the assist and lays it in. Picked out the pass nicely. Boy, excellent start to the second half. They've missed just once in five attempts. And so it's Ross. He brings it up for the Magic. Kicks it to Gordon. Fultz with the ball. Young's there. Fultz, no good. And, and typically he has the touch to finish when he's in tight, but not sure on that position. Time out, time it's out. good. Yeah, they're going to have a nice little run here. Time call here. The Magic decide to talk it over. And he could tell his guys starting to wear down a little bit. Call time to just let them get their legs back under them. Orlando going with an almost entirely new group here. Bamba is checked in for Vucevic. Aminu comes in for Gordon. Fournier is checked in for Isaac. And DJ Augustine subbed in for Ross. Now here's Fultz. He's got six. And I love the way he uses his size there to make sure he gets that good. To the paint. Here's Jones. Oh, and the dunk by Jones. Parsons known for his scoring, but he is a big-time passer as well. Orlando trailing here. In the third quarter with just over three and a half minutes off the clock. Outside Fournier. Aminu against Parker. Augustine from outside. Drops in the tray. Augustine's got eight points. D.J. Augustine has turned himself into a feared three-point threat. Beautiful. Parker outside. 
from 12 feet out. And it's Orlando with the rebound. 146 left in the third. Pamba dishes to Augustine. Pass to Fultz. From deep. A fresh 14 for Orlando. Nice shot there by Bamba. This is a skilled, hungry offensive rebounder, and Mo Bamba's size and motor make him a problem on the windows. Turner passes to Reddish. Here's Jones. Aminu grabs the miss. Great rim protection to prevent him from converting. Beautiful. It's stolen by Reddish. Parsons on the wing. The Hawks again can't hit. And I'm not sure that is a shot that he should be taking. Well, it's hard to imagine that the play was designed to go in that direction. Boy, I'd be surprised if we see that again. And now, how about breaking out the statue of liberty on that dog? A nice way to pad that lead a little more. You're right. Here's Jones. No good again that time. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. That boy, to have someone back there who can erase your mistakes. What a big-time asset defensively. Augustine against Turner. With some arc, he takes it up and lays it in. Well, that's a nice play. You've got to read the situation and go to your floater game when necessary. We're at the end of the third, and we've still got a close one. Magic out in front, up by three. And we'll have the start of the fourth quarter for you as soon as we get back from this short break. And a quick look now at the State Farm assist of the game. And how about the big fella here showing us? He's got some point guard skill here with the tremendous setup. I'll tell you, in today's game, you want skill and decision-making at every position. And we're happy to have you back for more playoff basketball here in round one. Okay, now let's reset our laps courtesy of Gatorade all fueled up and ready to go for this fourth quarter. And so in the game for the Magic, Al Farouk Amino is out there with Bamba. Then there's D.J. Augustine. Then it's Evan Fournier. And it's Carter Williams in at the shooting guard position. He kicks it to Vucevic. Rebound by the Hawks. Land's got six rebounds in the game. Here's Aminu. Ejected by Len. Hey, Kev, you see the agility of Alex Len in good position for the spot. Magic leading by three. Here's Fournier. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Fournier's got the first basket as we get going in the fourth for Orlando. That is the pass to Hunter. Parker outside. Pass to Young. Takes the three. It's hauled in by the Magic. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. Well, he hasn't proven to be much of a floor spacer for them. He had the one three, but that was back in the first half. And Nikola Vucevic is going to pick up the foul. That'll be his second foul of the game. Gordon's checked in for Orlando. Terrence Ross comes in for Carter Williams. John Collins, he's checked in for the Hawks. Kevin Herter comes in for Reddish. Fourth quarter now. We're about a minute and a half in. Now, here is Young. He's covered by Isaac. It's good on the putback. Well, just terrific instincts right there from Alex Len on the offensive glass. Really impressive. 
as Fournier. No good that time. Good defensive work there by Young. I'll tell you, it has not been this guy's best night, but the teammates have been there to pick up the slack. Love it. Shot from the top of the key, and a little luck that time, but it drops. Now just a one-point Orlando lead. And the thing about Young's jumper, it's almost intimidating. And that unlocks so many other options for him. Here's Isaac. Shot clock at six. Shoots a three. And they force the shot clock violation. Great D. Boy, not on the same page there. And in a possession ball game, that's a big mistake. Markel Volt has checked in for Orlando. Young outside. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. And it's Volt with the ball for the Magic. They lead by one. On the line. And no good that time. And Atlanta will come the other way. I'll tell you, even though he's not playing his best basketball, the team has played well and picked it up. I love it. And he's an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. He is, and he picks the simple one-hand stuff to get the two points. Time call here. The Magic decide to talk it over. And looking to stop this run and get back on track. Really needs to settle his guys down right now and get them refocused. 